Welcome to Hardcore Garage. Welcome to Zip Tie. I mean, Hardcore? Hardcore Garage? got here. Hey, my name's Tyler. This is my uh, camper. This is his <laughs> camper and, it, and it's a glamper because it's freaking glorious. <laughs> uh, so I won this on eBay for $510 by accident in 2017. Uh, blew up the Iron Duke and it's got an LS lock and a beautiful blue interior. Nice. You did the swap yourself? Yeah, me and uh, another guy. And this thing drove all the way from where? Uh, about 45 minutes east of Cleveland. It's about three and a half hours. Nice. The five it's liter. from PA. How far is it lowered? Uh, probably six six. I don't know. It's pretty low. Fabulous blue interior, huh? Amazing. <laughs> And does this not have the third seats? No, nope. the back seats. Was an option with it. I actually have the nice. window sticker. Here we go. Check that out. Weirdly options. It's a base model with a bunch of weird options. This is the camper. Comes with donuts, pretzels, a bed rug. I know you like that. All right, man. We appreciate you coming out, Tyler. I'm totally digging that people are getting back into the camper shells, caps, toppers, whatever you call them, wherever you're at. But I love that look. Uh, open beds are great too, but it, I've just always, can you see it back there? <laughs> I've always loved that topper look, man. Just maybe I should have been a blazer guy. <laughs> Who knows? But uh, Tyler's truck is amazing. Plus the fact that it's got, I, I believe that's a 6.0 in there also. He just called it an LS, I believe. I'm going to interrupt right there and redo a little section here because that's where I screwed up. It is actually a L33 5.3. It's got a five speed with the AR5 trans and it's an 88. I didn't add that in there. And I want to tell you another little story that he had told me after I talked to him a little bit more about that. He actually had threw a bid of $510 on this truck in November of 2018. And then he forgot all about it. He just let it ride. And like a week later, he got a message saying that he won. <laughs> and the truck hadn't been registered in like 20 years when he went and got it. So it is truly a barn fine, guys. And I don't know if he mentioned it in the video, but it does have AC and power steering on that Iron Duke, which is kind of odd to see. Um, my 90 does have AC, but it doesn't have power steering. So they were, they were optioning these things really, really weird back then. Kind of interesting fact. It even came with an EQ radio. <laughs> awesome, right? <laughs> and then he camps in and he has his little screen over the top and, and Tyler is a heck of a dude. He's also into old Oldsmobiles and other odd vehicles. So that's always cool to see what he's come across, in, you know, in the most recent times. Um, uh, I think I got one more, at least one more walk around from the takeover. Maybe two. We'll just have to see. Hope you guys are enjoying it. Um, I, you know, I get wrapped up in the moment. I like to say that a bunch, and I and I feel like I could do a little more in depth. I like it when the people talk about their rides, also when we're doing these. But I, I, I don't know when I'm back, watching them back. I'm like, man, why didn't I like ask this or that or I don't know. I'll get it eventually. <laughs> Y'all take it easy. Keep watching. Share, like, comment. You know the drill. Keep on trucking.